Hello, I'm Marty Fleckman, Director of Instruction at Black Horse Golf Club. Today we're going to go over what I've talked about the last several months. Now one of the most important things in producing a good ball flight is you got to return the shaft angle back at impact close to where it was at address. If my shaft angle is here at address, when I make contact with the golf ball, I want it basically in the same position. I do not want my left arm to be up. That makes the shaft more vertical. I'll either hit behind the golf ball, I'll push it to the right, or over rotate the shaft and the ball will go to the left. Just kind of remember something, that there are two motors in a golf swing. There's the arm and hand motor and there's the body motor. We want the body motor to be going in the same direction as our, as our arm and hand motor. So if my arm and hand motor is going to the left in the same direction as my body motor, I will hit probably good shots. But if my arm and hand motor, especially my left arm, is going down the target line or swinging too much in to out, it's not going in the same direction as my body motor. So all of a sudden I've got a roadblock and the normal body movement through the ball would be I'll be falling back on my right foot, my right leg. That would, be, that would telegraph to you that your arm and hand motor is not going in the same direction as your body motor. Now, remember, you got to return the shaft angle back at impact close to where it was at address. And if that'll happen, you'll create a, sh a tighter shot dispersion. You'll increase your, your length with every club because you're creating more club head speed. Remember, return the shaft angle back at impact close to where it was at address. Sometimes, if a person is too vertical and he's swinging too much out to in, that will interfere with what we're trying to accomplish here, okay? So listen, contact Marty Fleckman, Director of Instruction at Black Horse Golf Club, and we will determine if your club head is on the correct path and correct angle of approach.